All right, welcome. You made it. You came back. Thank you so much. This is the part two reaction to Kenneth Saran. Um, this is Alibata playing Iwin Falls' uh, famous song. I, I'm assuming it's famous because he's famous and Alibata is as well. And I'm looking forward to this because I always enjoy listening to Alip translate a piece of music onto one instrument. Okay, and, and that is not an easy feat. Uh, this is shorter. This is only about three minutes long versus the live concert footage of the Iwin Falls and his band playing. It was about seven minutes or so. But we're going to get the gist of the music. We're going to get the gist of the song uh, in, in very, very capable hands. So thank you guys so much for being here. Please check out my Indonesia documentary series. Please check out my Alibata reaction series. All of them. Go go to my playlists uh, tab and take a look how much, how many artists from Indonesia I have listened to. Love them all. Love them all. You guys have amazing talent there and amazing love, especially in the comments section. I I think this is this is the one group of people from across the globe that have been overwhelmingly supportive and loving. Okay, I. And I do not take that lightly. I do deal with a lot of trolls and a lot of people who are just downright nasty and negative. And those are mostly from the West. I will tell you that. Uh, but you guys from Indonesia, you're, you're my number one geography to watch my channel consistently. Uh, which is why I'm paying a lot of attention to you and your love and the amount of uh, talent that you have. is just overwhelming. So... That being said, this is from the ABT Guitar uh, YouTube channel. This looks like this was probably an alternate channel for him, or maybe the first channel before he has his Alibata channel. That being said, uh, this was four years ago. Only has 13,000 views, but that's okay, because we're going to watch it, and we're going to enjoy it. Are you guys ready?
sincere thank you so much again such a great 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 um retelling of the song okay first of all i'm always amazed at the body positions that he chooses when he plays especially in the seated position the way he is um that's not exactly an easy uh, position to play but he's found a comfortable position his his technique is very good as far as his playing hand uh and it, this was a nice slow tempo that really translated that feel of the song that i spoke of in part one still there and i love that he incorporated the harmonics and the percussive uh, slapping of the his pinky on the body of the guitar uh, just sort of a a timekeeping reminder for us but i was watching his face now his eyes were closed a lot of the times because uh, he was just feeling it okay muscle memory kicked in he knows his fingers know where to go um everything in his autonomic nervous system is is working the way that it should through memory and uh and he can just let go and not think about it and just play and that's very very important that means he's practiced quite a bit um and sometimes it just comes naturally as well but watching his facial expression where he was feeling the emotion of the song all right that's such an amazing amazing thing i don't know if you guys play uh, instruments uh but when you can get into the zone like that where you can just focus on the feeling and you could just play knowing you're not going to be making those mistakes uh, it really is an otherworldly feel uh what else can i say about this i mean it it again the feel of this song from the original to this one remained the same it's that original song is in great hands with him okay i mean you're talking from one generation to the next uh, there was no change in in the meaning of the song the emotional context of the song uh, he added a little something to it making it a finger style uh, and i i think about that lyric in the line where in in the song um and watch the waves crashing over seagulls flying and playing in the crash uh where is it where is it meanwhile the rays of the sun slowly setting the sounds of your guitar playing a melody about love and I thought for a moment, isn't that such a maybe, <laughs> you know, transcending time and space? Um, he was singing about Olip playing that, you know, or, or Olip assumed the role of that person in the lyric that was playing guitar. I could easily see that being uh, something, you know. Uh, so just very cool. I love what music can do for us with our imagination, with our emotions. Uh, how it can inspire us and uh, it can be a catharsis it can soothe us uh, it can definitely be there for us to lean on in times of, of emotional stress as well so very cool very awesome mr alabata guys thank you so much once again for joining me uh god bless you jesus loves you and i will talk to you later